Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to change location in the weather app. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, I'm on my iPhone and it comes default with this weather app. So I can tap on it and if you're new to iPhone and this is a new phone, it will default to Cupertino, which is where the capital or the headquarters of Apple is. Um, so I have a couple of different cities on here and at the bottom right you can see those three lines. I can tap on that and it will show me all of the cities that I have weather. Now you can do a couple different things. One is you can search for a specific city if you just want to add that city. However, you can also set it so that your iPhone will keep track of which city you're currently in and show you the weather for that specific city. So I'll show you how to do both. The first one at the very top here, I can just search for, let's say I'm gonna search for New York. If I want to search for New York, I can search for it and then hit add. And you can see that it's added New York to this list. And I can tap and hold on it and move it to the very top or the middle or the bottom wherever I want to move it in order. And then if I tap on it, it'll bring up the full screen and I can swap through all those different cities. Now, if I ever wanted to delete one, I can just swipe to the left here and it will delete that city from the list. However, if you want to add the ability so that your iPhone automatically shows you the weather where you're currently at, you have to get out of this weather app and go into settings here. Now, when we're in settings, we'll scroll down until we find weather here. And here at the very top, you can see location and it's set to never. So I can tap on that. And what you wanna do is set the location so that it can access your location. So I usually do while using this app. So while using this app, it can use my location. I don't usually do always, and you don't need to turn on precise location because it'll generally know where you are in any given city. So you can turn that on, and if I go back to weather here, immediately at the very top, it says my location. So now it's added my location to these weather, you know, bug weather um, widgets here, and I can swap through all these different ones. Of course, if I go to a different city, say I fly to Miami, it will switch my location and the weather associated with that to Miami. So it's pretty nice because it'll tell you the weather where you currently are. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.